Hi, I am Karthik from Marketing Sales. Uh, welcome back to my MarkTech channel. In this video, I am going to uh, detail you about another interesting uh, AI phone agent uh, which is called Wappy. Uh, we have uh, earlier seen integration of uh, CRM with uh, Yari AI and Wappy is um, a little more advanced than Yari AI because it supports multiple uh, custom functions and other things. I will show you uh, 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 things one by one and uh, good thing is like um, the AA phone callers replaces the VAs and it uh, allows you to scale your uh, uh, outbound calls operations and uh, uh, when you when you uh, you can track the profile you can track it uh, and you can modify it to your needs and it do lots of wonders for you if at all you have set up everything perfectly but the setup uh, takes uh, lots of uh, uh, small small nuances and uh, because anybody can go and set up a preliminary thing but uh, when when you uh, when you have the complete control over the system and when you understand the complete flow of uh, data from one platform to other platform you can extract it much more uh, so that it can be more like a human agent calling your customers uh, let's get into the uh, um, details say i have a crm called gohoi level and from gohoi level whenever a customer is added yeah, they will say uh, for the uh, the client may ask for i i will they wish to dump like uh, 10000 contacts on a, on a single stage but we have to uh, calibrate it effectively so that it doesn't ruin their number or like uh, uh, or like it doesn't spam too many customers so uh, we, uh, we have to have a drip mode so it calls a customer uh, it calls up uh, 500 or 1000 or like 2000 customers a day and also you have to understand like what is the concurrent limit in VAPIs say at the same time how many calls can be made anyway whatever the calls you may uh, post it through wappy through ap it will be queued and then it will be called but even then the concur there is a concurrent limit there and we have to obey that concurrent limit like at a time wappy can allow this much calls only if you dump all the 10000 numbers in a single place the wappy won't be able to call it it will uh, uh, for not for your response and this uh, this workflow is simple like you can have to add a contact tag like it can be anything and as soon as the tag is added to the customers uh, that drip mode will start and then there is an out outbound web book it's a normal web book only not a custom web book not a premium action and once that is done the integration is done through make so that you can save uh, money because premium triggers and web premium actions are little exp uh, expensive but uh, when you when you go to make you have to mm, search contacts and everything you have to do uh, so it has to be um, um, uh, the scenario has to be made in detail uh, for the outbound call it would be very uh, little simple only let me show you like how i have made it like as soon as the web book is uh, instantly uh, received it will it will have we have a small delay so that the concurrent limit at the wappy is uh, mm -mm. Uh, followed or like obeyed and then it makes the http request to the wappy and this may look simple but the key thing comes into uh, comes here is like uh, the customer wants to call the uh, call the um, uh, yeah, uh, the client wants to call the outbound calls or the outbound customers with their first name and they have to the agent has to read out the address and a particular offer for them say you have an opportunity where in a stage like you have like uh, thousands of people and for those thousands of people are like for those tagged customers you want to give out a special offer so those data has to come from kohoi level to make and then make to wappy so this has to be managed this is the key here so that it can be much more personalized and you can say when a call agent calls you without your first name and just uh, tells you like whether you wish to willing to sell a property instead of that if if it tells the exact address of the property you have posted in a website or like uh, in zillow 
that would be uh, that would be much more personalized and it it will be much more convincing for the customer to engage with the ad agent uh, sorry the a agent phone caller uh, the, uh, this is where you have to have the complete understanding of the system and you have to personalize uh, personalize as much as possible so that it doesn't feel like a robo is calling the customers or like a bot is calling the customers and once this is done the call the calls will be queued and you can see all the calls recordings you have for a in in wapi you can have a knowledge base also you can upload the documents and you can train the wapi and this will uh, and wapi will use this um, knowledge base to answer those customer queries and also you can create multiple assistants and attach multiple numbers to them to route and you can have a detailed prompt where what it should do and and how the call should end and how, what what are the qualifying queries everything can be done and this is how the flow works from go high level to wapi and i i will show you yeah, the the main thing comes in capturing this data because just calling out those customers and the customer and the client may not want to manage two three platforms like make wapi and go high level every every data has to go back to uh, the crm so that it can be ma it can be managed accordingly and um, that is where capturing of the data comes into play and we have to tag the customers and we have to move the uh, move to a particular opportunity that itself is that is a very big task and uh, mm, that takes quite a lot of time to integrate uh, the review uh, the uh, to integrate the data uh, uh, from wapi to goho level crm